Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought maybe I would just tell you the story about how I obtained my first fur baby named Kingsley. Um, I don't know how I came up with that name. I randomly kind of just pulled it out of my ass, to be quite honest. I it was a very weird how we even got him so it's I didn't even have a name ready to be honest so first of all for those of you who don't know who Kingsley is he's sitting right next to me right now Kingsley cat meow we love you so that's mr. Kingsley I love him my house is Kingsley's castle uh, he runs the show he's it and what ended up happening is, um, so first off, my boyfriend is allergic to cats. Let's just throw this out there. So not at one point in our relationship did I think we were ever going to get a cat. Ever. Um, so going forward anyways, my boyfriend and I have been together since 2013. Uh, August and October. August is when we met. October is when he officially asked me out. So we've been together for a while. Uh, 2013, went through that year. 2014 rolls around and we decided that we were going to go into a house. Um, at first it was a rent to own. Well, it was just renting and then we decided to buy it in 2015. That can be a different story though. So in 2014 we have this beautiful house that we are still in today and it was kind of lonely we were all by ourselves it was just him and I and I didn't like being here alone I grew up with a bunch of animals I grew up with dogs and cats my whole life and so did he um and you know we were just kind of lonely in the first couple months just being us one day we were watching a basketball game um, in December it was about I think it was December 16th to be exact uh, and we are sports fanatics so watching some college basketball went to one of his friends houses it was a co-worker house and um, there was a big party going on had a couple other people over there and she actually is like a pet rescue person um, and so she had like three dogs and like I don't even know I think it was like five or six cats that were not her cats she has one dog and one cat and everything else in the house was to go to a good home and all that great stuff so we were there and hanging out and of course um, boyfriend Ty has been drinking and I was drinking and I was playing with Kingsley the whole time and his name then was Squawks because I guess all he did was meow back then and it wasn't like a cute meow it was like one of those Row! like you're dying type of a deal but um, he doesn't do that now so side note I think it was just because he was in that chaotic house with everybody else back to the story though I was playing with him all night and one of his other co-workers um, this guy named Tim was like you're gonna take him home you're gonna take him home that's your cat now and just giving my boyfriend shit and my boyfriend's like nah nah like I'm allergic to cats she would never ask which is true I would never ask because why would you ask somebody who's allergic to something to that's stupid but so we were just playing with them and I named him Kingsley for um, this girl and she's like oh that's a really pretty name so she started calling him Kingsley so the basketball game is over and remember it's December 16th so it's like only a week before Christmas and I remember sitting there petting Kingsley you know trying to tell him goodbye or whatever and we were getting ready to go and Ty asked the girl hey do you have an extra litter box and some food to get us through the night and my eyes like I was like what and I looked right at him and he was like Merry Christmas, Kingsley's your Christmas present, we'll take him home. What? Y you, you are allergic to cats. How are we going to do this? He convinced me, like, I'll take Zyrtec every day. You're getting the cat. Boys, it's just the snowplow. Ex Tito, no. Sorry. Little puppy madness in the background. We're dealing with some snow and ice today. Go Midwest. Um, but so I was completely shocked. I did not expect it at all. So we got to take 
Mr. Kingsley home that night and he has been at our house ever since. And his birthday is this upcoming March and he will be five. And I was never lonely again. And we had this beautiful King's a cat and he is my number one fur babe. And he acts like a dog. He comes to greet me when I get home. He'll sleep with you. He's the best. I love Mr. Kingsley cat. So that is my story on how we have gotten Kingsley. Well, got Kingsley. And now that's history. So I just thought that I would let you guys see a little bit into how I obtained fur baby number one. Um, I'm sure I will probably end up making a video on how I have the other, how I got the other two as well. Maybe not today, but I will definitely keep it in mind for a different day. So have a wonderful Thursday guys. Um, and I'll see you back probably tomorrow on Friday. Bye.